What's good, YouTube? This your boy Chi World back at y'all again with another art tutorial, man. Today I will be showing you guys how to create the tattoo effect. If you're new to this channel, go ahead, hit that like button, comment, subscribe, make sure you click post notification so you will be notified every time you budge drop some heat. Without further ado, let's jump right into this video. Okay, the first thing you want to do before you even start doing the technical thing, you want to first draw the tattoo. So I'm going to just draw a quick, a quick basic tattoo. Let me see. Let me set my brush. And make sure when you're drawing tattoos for your artwork to put on your character, make sure you put it on its own layer. So just create a new layer and you should title it tattoos. You know what I'm saying? But never put it on the same layer as the artwork. So just in case you want to change the color of the tattoos or whatever you, you want to do later, you'll still have that flexibility. Yeah, feel me. Okay, we're gonna draw him a little, a little tattoo real quick. I'm looking at a reference right now. Uh, I like Daffy Duck. So, give him a little tattoo. Like this. Sonic eyes. Okay. It's just for tutorial purposes, so it ain't gonna be perfect. As long as y'all get the drip. Okay, just say we're gonna add a little flame just to make it more make it more believable. You know what I'm saying? Throw some little flames off in there. Okay. And another thing you can do, we can um throw some money bags off in there. I'm just trying to make it look like a, a actual little tattoo before we start. I don't want to be too lazy. Also, when you're making tattoos, uh, placement is everything. So make sure you placing it in a dope spot. Like right now, I can tell like this ain't really. I'm finna center it a little bit so it'll look more believable. So let me move this over. Like right there. You know what I'm saying? So we got the money. You know, some people be getting their birthday. I mean, they date of birth tatted. So we just gonna say, uh, make him like a, a 2000 baby. Okay. Seeing a little more flames just to fill it in. It's all gonna make sense at the end. We just okay. Back. Let's see what else we can throw in now. Let's uh make this line a little bolder. I got a tattoo. Also, you can add text, you know what I'm saying? So we're gonna write like, we're gonna use the text. We're gonna write like money across his chest. Another thing to do too is uh, try to find some dope fonts. Go to Google and type in some fonts. So you can um, try to find like a dope cursive tattoo font you know what I'm saying so you 
gonna have to draw out the the letters. You can already find some that fit your picture. So I'm pretty sure I downloaded some some dope fonts. Let me see. Okay. Find one that find one that fit the vibe. And a lot of times they be having like free downloads for funds. So okay, these look like some. That look like a tattoo. Okay, cool. Got some money. Okay. Why you still got it selected? I come up here, put that little curve to it. You know what I'm saying? You just wanna fill it up, make it look full as possible. You know what I'm saying? I probably can add some little cloud bubbles. Wait, make sure I got the color black out. Okay, add a little. Make my brush a little bigger. What you want to do you want to select your tattoos everything you want to highlight everything at one time and since we use the uh text it's not text is not seen as a uh, the line work it's seen as a symbol so we got to do a little extra step to make it all become one so go to object then you want to go to expand appearance and then you want to go back to object since we got a symbol and go back to expand and then you want to hit OK. And that's how you turn your your symbol, create your symbol and make your symbol become one with your line work. Now go to Windows, go to Pathfinder, and go to uh merge on your Pathfinder so you can make your line work all become one. Now this is just the first part, like we already created the tattoos, now we finna do the effect. So what you wanna do is you wanna look inside your uh your swatches for the gradient. Let me see, go down the gradient. And I like to start at the top. And what you're looking for is the black gradient that go into the transparent gradient. You know what I'm saying? And after you do that, you just got to come over here. You play with these, play with these little levels. You pull this one down a little bit, you know what I'm saying? And then you want to come up here. You want to rotate where the gradient is coming from. Get it best to your liking. Let me tweak this a little more. Let's try to put, let's try to put the um, opacity high on this side. Let's go up some. Uh-oh. Went to the wrong thing. Opacity right there. Let's bring that up a little bit so it ain't all the way washed out. Because we want to have a little, a little tin in there. To it, bring this opacity up a little more. Bring these levels a little closer. And now, now I gotta go through with my white selection tool and delete the inner color right here, like this. I don't know why I just fill it in, but it's all good. I just go through manually and pick out the colors that I don't want. So let's come through here like this. Uh oh. Let's try to 
lagi ya Allah Allah adil hadut you know what I could have did I could have just isolated select the group that's not why I go wait go back to isolate select the group for my regular selection tool oh never mind there you go isolate select the group dang Delete the wrong thing delete this delete that get it that's how you do it man just keep trying to find it you got to keep playing with the gradient though till you get it exactly how you want it to flow where it kind of little washed out where it's like so imperfection that's how you make it look like it's really like onto the skin, you know what I'm saying? So just go through, take your time, and just do you, man, create your tattoos. That's how you do the tattoo effect. Please leave in the comment section of a, a, a tutorial you guys would like to see next so I can touch on it for you guys and see y'all next video.